How's it going, my friends? This is Anakis. Today we're doing a review for Transformers Legacy Drag Strip. So you have the artwork of him on vehicle mode in the front. You can see the figure right here in the wind plastic with the window. Uh, got artwork here. So you got Megatron, Drag Strip, Iguana, Skywarp, Kickback. Artwork of Drag Strip on this side. And figure in both modes on this side he is the first part of Menasaur who is my second favorite combiner team first is the Terracons but uh gonna enjoy getting him out of the box and checking him out finally but uh Go ahead and do that, and welcome to Anakis Toy Reviews. And so here we have Dragster out of the box, and he looks really good. See, he comes with these two black and purple guns, molded nicely. actually combine them see these pegs go right into these slots and you can't hold them like this also and I'm sure this will factor into the Menace are combined mode when we have all five members of the Stunts Guns. Now, Dragstrip himself, Head General Tate 360. Move these out of the way for the moment. Does have a hollow head, which actually does serve a purpose, and we'll get to that in a minute. Arms can rotate 360. T pose, there's a rotation here in the mid shoulder or mid upper forearm with that mushroom peg. His hands don't rotate, there's a pin joint in the elbow, waist swivel works very nice. He can kick up that far, he can kick back that far, he can do a super kick very well. The mushroom joint there in the upper middle leg. Knee can bend like that. That pin joint right there on that hinge. We'll get to that hinge in a second. And the feet can go side to side with this hinge right here. Oh, great posability. Paint absence is going to be almost a yellow plastic. You got this brownish gold here on the chest. The silver on this engine here. Red sideburns. Red visor. Good head sculpt. You got a little bit of red in this brownish gold on the bottom. On the box, it shows these right here being red. So it would go all the way up and around, but it doesn't. And then you know what? That's fine. I can I'm okay with that. For its transformation, take hold of the chest piece and bring it out and bring it up with that hinge. And you bring these the arms up with these hinges here. You wanna Rotate these parts here up and then you peg in right there, just like that. These forearm pieces can rotate downward. I don't know what that was. Bring the head in like that and you rotate this whole side. 
of bringing these wheel wells up and the arms can just of course now they don't want to peg in I'll work on that we can rotate the waist pieces and like the old combiner wars you just kind of hinge them forward <sighs> I hate it when they get some pegging when they're supposed to okay those are supposed to peg in right there and these pegs go into right here is race car mode so you have the split silicon symbol right there the back of the legs expose these uh, real engine covers or engines are right here you got your car controls and everything right there the seat take his guns so separate them again and they can just peg right in there and there and see what does a good duty do 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 as a great few atoms would say I got these clip on wheels that a lot of people don't like but you know I have no problem with them really no visible robot cable on the bottom. It's just great figure. And I'll uh, get him back into robot mode. And so I'll be right back. So we got him back in his robot mode. And I said I'm not going to go through his... Uh, combined mode I'll save that for when I get to doing the Menasaur build and review but to separate there's a in case you were wondering this hole right here that's how you separate them and I'm hoping the mechanism is going to be like that with the others. Because that'll be a lot of fun to just switch them back and forth. Like, ah, I got that in his legs. Oh, no. How did this happen? So that'll be fun. Anyway. Drag strip here is red, still readily available in all your favorite websites or retail shops. I've seen them there. At Targets and Walmarts several times definitely worth picking up him and probably the rest of the Suntacons it's going to be a fun build definitely give this figure a 10 out of 10 I've said it before I'm saying it again Hasbro is killing it with their figures there might be a price point hike but you know we're paying more money for better quality I have no problem with that whether it's action figures or a restaurant. So, do you like this figure? Do you like Transformers? Do you like Venomized Captain America speakers? Give me a thumbs up down below. Like, share, subscribe. Whack that bell for notification. And just remember to keep hitting those toy aisles. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.